in American universities, philosophy is often classed with the humanities. And I think it belongs in the social sciences. Uh, it, the kinds of things it does is much more relevant to social science than compared to uh, uh, people who study literature, uh, things like that. In a way, philosophy is to social science what mathematics is to the natural science, you know, um, involving improved precision, better concepts, uh, better ways to think about what we are doing. Philosophy and psychology, and I love both fields, uh, they have different strengths. Uh, philosophers uh, are very careful about ideas, exact, precise distinctions, um, thinking things uh, very carefully and arguing over borderline cases. In psychology, we can do experiments to study causal processes, uh, so we don't worry so much about the boundaries. Uh, we can go to the main case and study what affects what and what produces what. In this way, the two fields complement each other uh, and they can offer uh, each other a great deal. That psychology can benefit from philosophy uh, from having its theories uh, criticized and improved and to become, again, more careful, more precise uh, in our thinking, which is something historically we've not, not been the best at. Um, in contrast, philosophy can learn from psychology. Uh, we can show that things are related and things that work together. Um, for example, uh, in, in my own work, um, I was able to show in experiments that the limited resource, you know, after people exert self-control, then uh, their decision-making is, is weaker. And after they've made a lot of choices, then their self-control is weaker. A lot of the philosophy books on, on free will will use examples from self-control and from rational choice, but there's no way in philosophy to show that these things are related, that they really belong together. We can show that experimentally and give that back uh, to the philosophers, and they can help us understand the implications of our work better and uh, apply to other things. So uh, again, my sense is uh, philosophy has a great deal uh, to offer psychology, and uh, I hope in reverse as well.